guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'll be sharing with you a grocery haul. All of the items came from Walmart and we did grocery pickup because it's just so much easier right now. We ended up spending about $265 and this is the food for most of the month. I also had to go to Sam's Club soon to get some more stuff, but I will do that in a separate video. So let me show you what we got. All right guys, so in this haul, I have the ingredients as well for Christmas Eve dinner that I normally do every single year. And I wanted to start off with some jumbo shells. I'm making this for dinner. I might be tomorrow night. I did a menu for two and a half weeks, three weeks. And basically, I buy what I need and the rest of the ingredients I already have. So I got one of those. And pretty much, if I can get an item, a uh, store brand, I definitely will. I also picked up some Country Time Strawberry Lemonade for the kids to put in the kids' small refrigerator that I keep over there. We also got these uh, Christmas tree cakes. My kids and husband are obsessed with these. I mean, I'm not crazy about them, but this is their favorite, so they, um, we picked up a box. This is my kids' favorite gummies. These are so good. These are the Juicy Bursts, and they actually have juice inside them, so when you chew it, the juice bursts out, and it's so good. Actually. We tried the sample that Walmart gave us and we have been buying it ever since. I got a small thing of buttermilk so when I make red velvet cake, I get the boys the organic um, whole milk. And the reason I get organic, it may cost more but the expiration date lasts a lot longer. We don't have to rush through the milk. So it takes two, three months and they, 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 they will drink it before then but it just lasts longer and it tastes so good. Destiny's pre is lactose, so she drinks lactate. And y'all, I tested lactate. It's so delicious. I actually like it more than regular milk. I also got some Lando Lakes uh, half stick butters. I actually got the regular um, sticks, but they substituted for this. I need to apologize if I sound stuffy, you guys. My nose is so, so stuffy. I got, uh, how many cans did I get? Like six cans of French style green beans. My kids love these. And then this is my favorite oatmeal, which is the Raisin Dates and Walnut. It tastes so good. I got some ricotta cheese for the lasagna. I also got some crumbled goat cheese for the lasagna. And some cottage cheese for the dinner I'm going to make in a few days. I also got some tortellini for a recipe. And it was almost out of paprika, so I got some paprika. And then I got some ground mustard because a lot of the um, recipes I tried, I noticed they asked for this. So I got some au jus gravy for another recipe for like a, a cube steak. So I will definitely be trying that. Some red potatoes. I roast these in the oven with some kielbasa and green beans and red onions. It's so good. I got this for the kids in the morning. They pretty much, I'm trying to teach them to be self-sufficient. And the boys pretty much make their own breakfast and they even help their sister make her breakfast. So they warm these up in the morning and make their own breakfast. I ordered a 32 ounce bag of broccoli, but they substituted it for three bags. I got a bag of spinach. Let me see what's behind here. Also, I got these, the cube steaks. So I got two packs, so it could be enough for everyone because each pack comes with four. Everyone's pretty much getting the Elf on the Shelf cereal this time of year. We've been eating it for, what, two, three years now, I have to say. I'm going to get a bigger box from Sam's Club. This is just for now because I wasn't able to make it to Sam's Club. So Walmart has this buttermilk sprinkle pancake mix. So y'all know my kids love pancakes, so I will be making this for them. And then they also, I also got them the hot chocolate pancake waffle mix. Now, I've never tried these before, but I'm sure they are delicious, so I can't wait th to make these for them. My son Devin's favorite cereal is Frosted Flakes, so I got him a box for now, but I always prefer to get them from Sam's Club because the box come in, in a bigger size and they last me all month. I got some Apple Jacks and I got some Honey Nut Cheerio, which is Destiny's absolute favorite cereal. So I got two bananas. They substituted for the organic ones because I ordered just the regular kind, but that's what they gave me, which I am not complaining. I love when they substitute for organic products. I ordered a big bag of 
green beans, but they substituted it for three bags. I guess it didn't have the big bag. I also ordered some black forest ham for a recipe. Y'all know I love drinking tea. So I got the sweet grapefruit everyday immune and the tummy tea. Sometimes my kids have stomach uh, tummy aches and stuff. And I, I want to have something like this around for whenever that happens. So I got one big can of enchilada ca uh, not casserole, enchilada sauce and two cans of crushed tomatoes. I got some more popcorn seasoning. I got the garlic parmesan because I have the other flavors, but this is the one I ran out of. Some more bananas. One pack of Kobe Jack Monterey cheese and one pack of mozzarella. And this is for the lasagna. I always eat lasagna on Christmas Eve. It's like a tradition. One red onion. A few packs of the Idahoan um, buttery homestyle mashed potatoes. I like to have these around. It makes for a quick dinner. Some strawberries, which I will be soaking in some vinegar. It helps them last longer and it cleans them very well. I ordered some basil and they gave me two packs because I ordered, where's the other pack? Sorry, you guys. So they gave me two of these. I got some parsley. I noticed they gave me, oh, oh, they gave me all organic. Okay, I'm not complaining. I love when they sub substitute stuff for organic. So I ordered a big bunch of parsley and they didn't have any. So they gave me this one and a thing of cilantro, which will not be enough. I'm gonna have to get some more, but they um, substituted to all organic. I love doing grocery pickup, you guys. It's so much easier. I always use slow cooker liners for my slow cookers. It's so much easier. When I don't use a slow cooker liner, I regret it every single time because I have to scrub the pot. This makes it so much easier to clean. I got three bags of white chocolate chips. I use it for baking, but I also use it in our hot cocoa. So good. But I have a few cookie recipes that I need, need it for. I got some fresh mozzarella and these are sliced. And this is also for the lasagna recipe. Two packs of the kielbasa and that will be with the, for the potato, red onion and sausage um, baked that do in the oven. It's so good. I've shared that recipe over on my other channel before. I needed two lemons. We were completely out of bread. So we got five loaves. We always keep bread in the house. So what I do is I keep one out, but the rest are frozen. You can freeze bread. You do not have to worry about it being soggy when you thaw it out. All you have to do is leave it on the counter and start out within a few hours and it looks exactly and tastes exactly how you put it in the freezer. So do not be afraid to freeze some bread. I actually got four cans of whipped cream, but we have a, also a refrigerator in the garage that we keep all the extras in. So we put the other ones over there. And I forgot to mention that I got two gallons of each milk as well. And we put that over there. I got six cans of navy beans. Did I get six? No, I got four cans of navy beans, six cans of corn, two cans of cream of chicken condensed soup, two cans of French onion soup, one thing oh i got three things of salt i like to keep salt in the house um it's been a year since i bought salt and i'm completely out which never happens so i didn't have any salt and now we good i put the rest on the shelf my husband got himself some what's this some soda i don't drink soda you guys it hurts my chest so we love the cran grape uh, juice, but Walmart has their version, their brand that comes in a bigger bottle and tastes exactly the same. So, um, we get two of these is the other one is actually in the other refrigerator in the garage. Some Dr. Pepper and some Powerade. We also got the Milo's lemonade and you guys with every, pretty much every grocery pickup, they give us free stuff. So this one has the snowman bag. And I don't know if all Walmarts do this, honestly, but this one came with some Aveeno lotion, which I will keep in my purse. What else is in the bag? Some more teas. I get this almost in every bag. I don't like them. Our kids love them, but I don't. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, y'all. I have never seen them put this in the bag. Okay, I'd have no refills though. Why didn't it just put the refills in there? Um, or did they put the base bells? No, they didn't. Some cereal. So that's very convenient. What else is in the bag? Um, hmm. Tiny Tate's 
S Southampton, New York crispy cookies. Okay. Okay, what else is in the bag? Two more items, you guys. Okay. So we have some milk chocolate caramel, which I'm about to devour right now, and some more coffee. Just what I. So we will be going to Sam's Club pretty soon. I might. We might go tomorrow, and I'll make sure to film that, you guys, and show you what we got from there. But this is pretty much for the rest of this month. I like to shop that way. I like I make a menu and I know what I'm gonna cook and I get the things I need for that recipe or meal that I'm making. I always make sure to know what I have in my pantry and refrigerator. Sorry, I'm coming down with a cold, you guys. So everything was $265. I hope you enjoyed this haul. Don't forget to give it us a like and subscribe to my channel if you have not done so already and keep a lookout for my next videos, guys. Bye.